My mom is very open-minded. As long as you behaved. She had this magical quality. She was completely uninhibited. My mother, I remember having, she would buy these sets of the great books, you know, and she would start at the beginning and read straight through to all of them, you know. Um, she really encouraged us to become whatever we wanted to become. And when I started writing, they just loved that idea. As a mother, it's hard trying to write books and raise a family and be the sole support of my daughter for many, many years. But I think children are part of life. And my daughter is the joy of my life. My mother taught me to read and to write. And uh, reading, I wanted to be able to read. And I was about three, I think we had uh, China on the kitchen table, which had milk or sugar or cream or whatever written on it. Well, what does that say? It says cream. How does it say cream? Oh, well, what does that say? I, I think I was very, very demanding. I don't know how she survived me. I always wanted to have children and was thrilled to have them. And really, I think my goal in life, because I was a 50s housewife, was to be a wife and mother and to make the best possible home for my family that I could. And I enjoyed it very much, the domestic aspect of my life. And I loved having babies. That was absolutely wonderful. And I think it enriched my life and eventually enriched my work. I think all experience enriches one's fiction anyway.